the, the tie-breaking protocol has been kind of a point of discussion, if not a point oh, of yeah. contention. Oh, yeah. I saw one where it was just based on your seed. I yeah. was, that, that was one that I wasn't too happy with. But so is Izno versus Toasty, Game & Watch versus Palutena. Now, I feel like this is a very heavily favored matchup for Palutena. Mm -hmm. Uh, you know, big hitboxes, early kill power. Um, and also the auto reticle versus the bucket isn't going to be that big of an issue. You know, th this is a character I play as well. I've played the matchup. If they bucket the auto reticle, it's not that strong, actually. So that's something that like, most characters are not going to want to throw out projectiles against Game & Watch for fear of the bucket, but it doesn't really change. I don't think Kalutu is that worried about it, no. Right. Okay. But also, it's going to be one of those characters he can kind of just throw hitboxes out mm -hmm. at. Speaking of throwing out hitboxes, I think Game & Watch to the players, by and large, they are some of the most uh, hitbox-friendly players. I was going to say die-hard fans. They, yeah, they are die-hard fans of hitting some buttons, especially us, especially a lot of situations. Oh, my God, that move is so good. It's going to be very important for Toasty to play around it right now. Now, Explosive Flame, I can't attest for how strong that bucket yeah, is. Yeah, we're about to find out because I think it almost filled it up. He's it did fill like it up. So. It's definitely full Toasty. You know what, it's a double-edged sword because Toasty can now throw out the explosive flames yeah. without worrying about the bucket, but at the same time, he has to be careful of getting hit with the oil, oil panic. Uh, we don't get to find out. He ends up missing oil panic and going right back into it. That's unfortunate, because that could have been an equalizer right there that he was looking yeah. for. Fire Def coming in clutch. Up special is so good from Game & Watch. All right, there's Jeb. Just going to force Toasty off stage. All in all, though, this isn't looking too bad for you, no. Yeah, it's got to pick up one of those patent like game right, Now it's looking kind of bad. Yeah, it's the combos. Oh, I like the counter, but the downer canceling out just a little bit before. He uses explosive flame to cover his landing. Yeah, yeah it looks like uh, Toasty doesn't really have any fear of the bucket. Yeah, he's just throwing out. Says, you know what? You can bucket it, but I'm just going to avoid it again. Yeah, like. you're going to have to hit me. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know, come and get it. Uh, gets a forward air to cover his landing. That's an interesting. Oh, nice teleport cancel right there. Or the warp cancel, I suppose with the platform gets the back here afterwards. So he's on the ledge right there. Back throw, is back it on just line. does it. Back throw just does it from almost center stage. <laughs> I assume the DI can't have been that great for Izno. Yeah, you know, as far as gaming watches, when they start falling behind, it seems to like be genetically coded into all the mains. Uh, Judgment Hammer starts to come out as a desperation play. It's a move that, that has a one in nine chance of just killing you. Right. You know, I understand where they're coming from. If you get it, cool. If not, you know, it's Kind of not the best look. Yeah. But sometimes when you're that far behind, you got to make some plays and make it happen. So we'll have to see. I right now, sticking to the game plan, just trying to get back on stage. Toasty with the great use of these F tilts, actually. Not a move we see too often from Palutena. He just goes up there and does it. That's going to kill an 80. Yeah, no fear of the key. Man, well, like, I'm up the there. thing is, like, the key, the hitbox isn't that huge. Yeah. But, like, Palutena's up air is so much, is so big both above and in front and behind her, yeah. that like he can space it so he goes around the key and still hits Game & Watch. And also, it takes a little bit of time to start up because you have the stall and then the fall. Yeah, the and he caught him right, right in the stall section of it, said, you know, furiously, I'm going up out here, especially because he was low percent and it wasn't going to be, if he missed, he's not going to die off the top, so. Yeah. He gives away, Toasty feeling confident, feeling good. You know, Isno definitely having to make some plays here because, as we were saying, we got a three-way tie brewing. All right, quick 46, 56% onto Isno right now. Yeah, that up here is probably stale at this point. Please don't neutral <laughs> get up. The, the roll actually got caught, but, like, dead zone, I guess. Yeah. Or, like, mistiming, something happened. But it looked like it, it could have hit, which is not okay. Uses the landing neutral air, gets some back airs, turtles and aquariums. You know, name of the game for Game & Watch. Maybe trying to chase a little too aggressively in these situations, Toasty being very elusive and baiting some of the aggression coming out from Isno. Yeah, and even like when Toasty isn't hitting uh, his shield, he's looking for these uh, up these out of shield. Yeah, you can see he's already scouting out to contend. He knows that you know, Game & Watch, they just want to up special and fire away. And just if you're able to cover afterwards when they're coming back down, it's a lot easier sometimes. And the invincible dash track right there just going to beat out the uh, the backer right there from Game and Watch. And down to a covered fire, covered you know the ledge, not letting him recover too for a minute. All right, this should be a dash pack, and that will kill Game and Watch. Uh, one of the lighter characters, you know, and dash yeah. attack and uh, that, from Palutena. And you know that move kills pretty early, especially yeah. if you don't die correctly, which you know at that close range it's kind of hard to react to. Yeah. 
Um, DI didn't it look like so he went straight off the top instead of to the side? Right, it didn't look like there was any sparks, so probably a missed DI input yeah. somewhere in there. But I feel like that happens quite a bit with that move, right. actually. Especially because it's the first option that yeah. catches you off guard. You're not ready for it. You know, you're trying to hold in and approach, and all of a sudden you're just off the top. Triple forward air chain right now, just looking like Sheik, and he goes off and down heals him! Toasty looking for the three. Did he just taunt on him? <laughs> Toasty is saying, like, you know, this game watch about to be cooked right now. Says, you know what? I had a one game limit I could drop today. I've already done it. Let's just close it out nice and clean and uh, good, luck dealing with the, good luck dealing with that uh, tie at the other side of it. Yeah, best of luck. Hope you make it out. But you know what? Toasty going to punch his ticket. One more stock is all it's going to take. Yeah, everybody wants to make it into the dance. There's no Cinderella's here in the Arcadian. Got to earn it. Okay, F tilt, no, no free stock for Toasty. JV? Got him with the chair and uh, picking him right, right back where he left off. Yeah, he does, does not really seem to have an answer for the uh, game that's piloted in there. There it is. He There's that throw the, the, the judgment hammer. <laughs> All right, landing here back. You're just going to poke through the shield. Toasty has to find a way to land if he wants to take the stock. And now it's, you kind of see Isno holding on to this last stock actually has caused him to play a little more passive, a little more slowly. Well, yeah, I think, you know, building back, uh, taking away from some of the lead, but a good grab confirmed coming out from Toasty. Yeah, I think Toasty's kind of stopped playing like, oh, I've already won, and says, you know what, I have to, I have to figure out how to actually close the game. Right. You know, nothing's impossible. Isno could still bring this back. He just has to avoid quite a bit. Back though, not going to do it. Good DI. Not enough to eat it, but... And the recovery situation, oh, the wow, it, it didn't hit the last. It's kind of good presence of mind from Isno to come back is, you know, you weren't sure where you're going to end up going. Yeah. And Tosi's, you know, feeling it, kind of the pressure mounting just a little bit. Okay, yeah, definitely missing some punishes right now. A little bit of nerves, says I, I really like to not. Oh, that'll do it. Can't miss that punish. Yeah. Back throw from Palatina. The saving I mean, grace. Toasty going 7-0 in his pool. And they drop you a single game. Only Good stuff one. to him. 